Well, it wasn't too cold for parents and their children to get out to walk just a bit this morning. A lot of them did to try to improve their health. Today was the 13th annual International Walk to School Day. Fox 11's Mark Leland found some walkers in Alloway, but also found there are obstacles to better health. Of all the children nationwide who head off to school in the morning, safety experts say only about 10% actually walk. Most get a ride by a parent or the bus. Walk to School Day looks to change that in order to promote better health. It is a great time for parents to just reinforce the fact that walking is safe, walking is good for kids. It's an awareness building day. At Webster Elementary in Alloway, hundreds of kids and dozens of parents started their day early with an organized student wellness and safety event. Those who turned out then walked as a group to the school doors. This morning's walk is a one-day event, but it's designed to get kids and parents to think about exercise and walking every day. Do, do you always walk to school? No. No? How come? Because um, my grandma usually drives me. I like walking to school in the summer more than in fall and winter because it's colder. Teachers say students who walk show an advantage in class. I do think that the kids who walk to school end up being more alert, have gotten a little bit more energy out, um, and seem to be more ready to listen and learn. For some, walking is not an option. They live too far from school. For others, walking remains a safety concern. Vicki Seidel drives her kids. Once you get up here by St. Joseph Street, there's not really a lot of sidewalk, and so I guess I'm not really comfortable with just letting them take off. The village of Alloway is working to put in more sidewalks where they don't exist to encourage more walking and healthy living. More Americans become overweight as they grow older, according to federal statistics. The numbers reinforce the need to start encouraging kids at an early age to exercise daily. The message here, it's as easy as taking one step at a time. In Alloway, Mark Leland, Fox 11 News. Now, at Webster Elementary, the healthy start to the day did not just end with the morning walk. The school went ahead and organized a breakfast for the students to try to make sure their day started healthier and more nutritious.